welcome to my house. Hi everyone, Marlene here with Buffalo Check Chicks. In today's video, I will be showing you how I styled this beautiful Tuscan tablescape. I'm starting off with a nice clean and freshly polished table and I have taken two chairs out so I'm setting a table for six now let's start off with this table runner I love this um, it is uh, it reminds me of Tuscan it has the roosters on it and the sunflowers it's kind of a deep burgundy color and it's just pretty. I've had it for years and I'm going to pair that up with these placemats and they're like a golden straw color and I bought these recently at Ross. You'll see that so many things on my tablescape has been thrifted. Now this is my very first attempt at a Tuscan tablescape and I have really enjoyed doing this. So I really love the color of these placemats. So I'm going to use my chargers and these by the way were thrifted a few years ago and they're nice heavy duty chargers and they're a really pretty gold color but I love the little braid around the uh, edge of this. And these are my standby go-to chargers. I always use these. I just love them. So here are those plates that I bought. And they're almost like a pasta bowl. Um, I don't know if they're plates or bowls, but they're just beautiful with uh, the sunflowers on them. And these were thrifted fairly recently and they are just beautiful I was so pleased to find them so I'm trying to turn each plate uh, with the sunflower the largest sunflower flower up at the top And these really look Tuscan to me. Just maybe it's the sunflower, but the color and everything, they are just gorgeous. So it's already starting to come together. Now next, I'm going to place this centerpiece. Now I didn't show you putting this together and I'm sorry but I thrifted the basket and all I did was throw some old greenery in the bottom of it and then uh, these fruit pieces, the pears and apples and um, let's see what else is in there. I think there's a bell pepper in there and they were all thrifted and I basically just put them right in the basket oh and the grapes I can't forget the grapes so here I'm gonna add the uh, beautiful wine glasses 
in a golden color and I've had these for years and seriously I've probably had these for 20 years and I had a set of eight and recently broke my very first wine glass so it left me with seven but since I'm doing the tablescape for six it worked out perfect This is what it looks like so far. Okay, so I'm going to add my napkins. And again, I've had these for years and years. They're um, a real pretty, it's a deep rust color. But I really like the texture of these napkins. And I have just placed them inside a wooden napkin ring holder that I have had for years and I'm just gonna place one at each setting I really love the colors of this tablescape. The golden uh, colors and the rust and the actually a little red, some greens. It just looks so Tuscan. Okay, I think that, that is uh, the last one. And this is what I have. So beautiful. So this is a plate that I also recently thrifted and I'm just going to uh, place it in this little plate holder and set it up on the table. And it's like an eggplant color with a golden center and I just think the colors are beautiful. And this poor little rooster, I love him. Anyways, he was also thrifted. And I'm going to set him right in front of the plate. So these topiaries, again, were thrifted. And I painted the pots on these in a uh, really pretty terracotta color. And added a little moss. So I'm going to place these on the table. When I think of uh, Italy, I think of uh, all the beautiful greenery. And I don't know if you've ever been to Italy. I love Italy. And I would like to go back. But uh, it's just beautiful. And here's a little pot. Well, it's... I guess it's a, a vase or a picture. That's what it is. And that was also thrifted. And it's real pretty in a golden honey color. And it's part, um, well, it's terracotta. And here's the other topiary. I'll set on this side. This is really the fun part for me is deciding what I'm going to do for decorations in the center of the table and uh, putting that all together. It's just a lot of fun. A little pear that I found uh, recently at Goodwill and I'll go ahead and set that on the table. It kind of matches the pears that are in the centerpiece. Now I've had these uh, candlestick holders for a long, long time, and uh, they're pretty ornate, and they do remind me of Tuscan, and I'm going to set these right next 
to the topiary and atop each one is uh, my battery operated candles and what I do on one side I usually do on the other so here's the other one I love this. So I've had these mirrored, I don't know what to call these. I'm going to call them a, a mirrored topiary for lack of better words. And um, I decided to go ahead and place these on the table just because I love the beauty of mirrors. They just reflect and shine and I just thought they would look so pretty right here next to the centerpiece. And this is coming out so beautiful. I really love it. decided to use my gold uh, flatware and I'm going to go ahead and place uh, just a, a knife, spoon and fork at each, each place setting and that will complete my tablescape. And this flatware we've had for a long, long time, and I, I use it often. But there's the table. So pretty. I just love it. Now, if you notice over there in the corner, I've got a wine barrel, and it's decorated. And I'm going to take you around and show that to you as well. But there's my tablescape. I'm really pleased. Now on my beverage cart, I decided to put, uh, well I have a basket there, inside I've placed some extra linen napkins, this, um, well it's a water vessel I guess, or a vase, I found at Goodwill, and uh, I think that came out real pretty over there in the corner, and I'll walk you around the tablescape. I am so happy with it. Let me know what you think in the comments. So here's that uh, wine barrel over in the corner. This belongs to my daughter actually. That picture I found at Hobby Lobby years ago. And here's the wine barrel. And on top, I have placed some greenery. And I have some grapes and florals. And one of my favorite roosters. And it matches the one up in the picture pretty well. And isn't that cute? So now I'm going to share with you some of my pictures from when I toured Italy and I really want to thank all of you so much for watching my Tuscan tablescape and I'll see you soon. Love you guys. Bye for now.